It's about time. What's going on? Yo. Yo. Rumor Report. Rumor Report. This is the Rumor Report. Talk to him. With Angela Yee on The Breakfast Club. Oh, and also happy birthday to Lisa Lisa today. I just saw on social media. I used to love Lisa Lisa when I was a kid. I know some of y'all might not know Lisa Lisa. Yeah. Younger ones, but she's dope. Salute to Lisa Lisa. Respect the cold jam. Mm-hmm. I don't even know who the cold jam is. I just know you know. <laughs> <laughs> that was her crew. You Lisa Lisa and cold jam. Yes, yeah. <laughs> All right, now Lil Yachty is showing off his new teeth, and he was on Instagram Live. He, you know, he had all those jewels and everything in his teeth. Here's what he said: you "Got the new teeth, man. You know it. <laughs> you would have thought it was picture day. Oh God, oh God. <laughs> hey, who, 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 that mo- eighty k? That mo- with eighty. I thought cool eighty. I went same, same, same dentist as Young Thugger." I love to see young brothers investing in their teeth, okay? And I love to see the humble flexing. We do that little laugh. Like, ha, ha, just a cool lady. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> just a cool lady. Can't stop smiling. Thought you yeah, thought it was picture day. Change your life, new teeth. All right, now Tommy Davidson talks about uh, Jennifer Lopez actually snubbing him after she got famous. You know, they were on and Living Color together. So he was on Wendy Williams, and here's what he said. Yeah. I hadn't seen her in a long time. Uh, she became... Hugely famous. And so you um, said hi to her, and how long ago was this? 15 years ago. And what like And that. what did she do to you? She gave you the, the, the snub? Uh, yeah, we were both at the little cracker and, and um, cheese table at some function. And I was like, girl, oh man, you're blowing up. This is really cool. I had a carrot. I was about to eat the carrot. And she was like, yeah, and walked away. I was like, maybe something's wrong with this carrot. You know, in, in okay. her defense. Mm-hmm. Mm. There was a time when Tommy Davidson was wild. He was uh, high on drugs and high on everything else. So in her defense, it might have been one of those times where she was like, I need to get away. Because there was a time when he was wild. No, I wasn't going to go that I wasn't going to say that. I was just going to say sometimes you forget you've stunted on people. So when she was a fly girl and Tommy Davidson was Tommy Davidson, she he might have mm. stunted on her and, and, you know, not remembered it. So she just returned the favor. Oh, she might have just feel like felt like not being. You just made a whole story up. We, <laughs> we both did. This is the rumor report. <laughs> Give me some more tea. Like, it's the rumor report. Remember the report. time she was trying to go to the bathroom on set of In Living Color? Tommy Davidson was standing there. She tried to walk past him, mm-hmm. and he pushed her. <laughs> and I remember the time when um, Tommy Davidson stole her dance move. So it was a routine the Fly Girls had came up go. with, and then Tommy took the routine and did it in a, 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 a sketch. So she might be holding a grudge from that. So pick one of them. One of them is the reason why. Whatever, pick whatever. A- we B, C, <laughs> rumor report. Or A, B, C, or D, all the above. All the above. That's right. <laughs> all right, now, Joe Exotic is very upset about not getting pardoned. He took to Twitter to express <laughs> his frustration. This is great. He said, I was too innocent and too gay. And he put it in all capital letters. Capital, yes, that's why I said it like that, because he put that in caps. I was too innocent and too gay to deserve a pardon from Trump. I only mattered to Don Jr. when he needed to make a comment about me to boost his social media post. Boy, were we all stupid to believe he actually stood for equal justice. His corrupt friends all come first. Now, how do we know that out of the 140, was it 140 people or 70 people he pardoned, whatever it was, Mm -hmm. how do we know some of those people wasn't gay? 43. Mm -hmm. We don't know if some of those people were gay or not. So how well, could, are there so any of the names that you know? I don't know. So how could Joe Exotic just throw a card out there and say, I was too gay? You can't play that card. You don't know what these other people are. He might have pardoned mad gay people for all we know. Mm-hmm. And I don't know about being too innocent. I was too innocent. Too how gay? Are you too innocent. You're either innocent or you're not. <laughs> <laughs> I was too innocent and too gay. Too innocent, too gay is hilarious. Okay? That should be the name of an album. All right? right like, how can you be too gay? I don't know. Like, he's mm. gay, but he's not too gay. Not too I mean, gay. that doesn't even make sense. He's too gay? How you, how, how, yeah, that's a good question. How are you too gay? Jesus Christ. Mm. All right. Jake Paul has announced his next <laughs> boxing match, and that's going to be happening on April 17th. Now, we don't know yet who his opponent will be. So, But that announcement is, uh, you know, he just recently was in the ring against Nate Robinson. He's 2-0 and right now after knocking out Nate Robinson. Mm-hmm. All right. Now, Gabrielle Union was on Jalen Rose's podcast on a New York on, for the New York Post. It's called Renaissance Man. And one of the things that she was talking about was her marriage with Dwayne Wade and her work that she does. Listen to this. How does your better half deal with your sex scene? He doesn't. <laughs> like he'll ask me before each episode, are you naked in this one? Are you, what are you doing? 
But sometimes I forget because we shoot these. I don't remember. Right. And he'll be, you know, we'll sit there with the whole family. And I'm like, oh, yeah. <laughs> but I think as, as I get older and, you know, I, I do factor that in is, you know, because the older boys were, were like, I'm getting murdered at school. Like, <laughs> like, like, with the, like with the sex scenes and all that. So I was like, cool, maybe I got to, you know, think twice. But as long as my ass is still sitting, I'm going to keep showing it. Oh, do your things, Gabs. She looks great. But I yeah, have she does. I love Gabrielle Union. And, and I have to say, I, I, the what? D Wade though, because I saw D Wade naked on the ground for his birthday. So you can't really say anything. He wasn't. He wasn't doing a sex scene though. I, he was naked on the ground. Somebody else. Yeah, he was. He was <laughs> naked on the ground, and I saw a lot of women. I saw a salute to Eb the Celeb. I saw a lot of women putting their head on Gabrielle Union's body in front of Dwayne Wade's naked body. So I mean, it's kind of the same thing, right? You're still selling, you know, sex in a Did way. Did you do that too? Did you put your head in? <laughs> no, I'm a married oh. man, sir. Okay. But one thing yeah, I it's not the same thing. It's like masturbation versus cheating. You know what I'm saying? If you had to do a comparison, it's either you're naked by yourself or you're having a sex scene. I wouldn't want my significant other to masturbate or cheat on the gram. Okay. <laughs> you don't want your significant other to masturbate? On the gram? No, I don't. Okay. Oh, I thought you just meant masturbate. <laughs> like, yeah, is that something you want to tell us? Like, what you doing on the ground? <laughs> One thing I can say about the Wades, though, they really be living their best lives. I mean, they are really, really free. We should all strive to have that uh, type of liber liberation and live our lives to the fullest. Salute to Dwayne and Gabrielle Union. All right. All right. Well, I'm Angela Yee, and that's your rumor report. And happy birthday to Jam Master J. Today is Jam Master J's birthday. So mm. rest in peace, Jam Master J. We're going to start the mix off with some Jam Master J. Revolt, we'll see you tomorrow. Everybody else, the People's Choice Mix is up next.